Average Joe Episode 6 Synopsis Episode 6 opens with a flashback to last Christmas when the Washington family received a gift from Joe's father. When they open the gift it's a deer head. Nobody in the family likes it, and they decide to put it in the attic. Meanwhile Joe and his friends are discussing their next move since their house is surrounded by cops. Joe's daughter Jennifer wants them to turn to Sergeant Talford for help. The others don't agree. Joe's wife Angela wants them to pack and flee but Joe convinces her to stay a while to look for the missing money. Sergeant Talford finds out that Joe's father Teddy died tragically in a house fire. She's trying to make a connection with the severed head they found when the governor arrives. The governor suggests that her cop mother who is in jail can be released if she stops investigating the Russian mobsters. She refuses. The Russian hit lady hired to find out what happened to the mobster's son kidnaps the two men who found his severed head and take them to her boss. Joe's cop friend Benjamin is shot by an unknown assailant who turns out to be Kathy. Benjamin is saved from serious injury by his bulletproof vest. With the distraction caused by Benjamin shooting Joe is able to sneak into his house to look for the missing money. He begins to search the attic. Jennifer accuses her mother of allowing Joe to boss her around. They end up in a heated argument. The female Russian hive woman has found Angela's medicine and tracing it to the pharmacy Angela uses to pick up her medicine. Sergeant Talford visits Benjamin and informs him that she is starting to connect Joe to his dead father's dealings with mobsters. Talford realizes that the shooting was probably a distraction and heads to Joe's house. Benjamin calls Joe and warns him Joe can't find the money and out of frustration starts beating on the deer head his dad gave him for Christmas. Joe is surprised by a mobster. Joe impales him with the deer head. Joe finds the money in the broken deer head. He puts the money in a bag and hides just as Sergeant Talford arrives. Talford asks the dying mobster who attacked him. He identifies a picture of Joe as his attacker. Angela, Jennifer and Leon are picking up her medicine. While Jennifer stayed in the store to buy some flowers the Russian hit lady attacks Leon and kidnaps Angela.